Right, so here it is, the video of a battle report. Here is the board, and we'll give you a quick run through the armies before we go to deployment. Oh, all right then, I've to start off with, I've got me four 12-man primary teams of gun drones. And for my elites, I've got three, oh, well, a squad of stealth drones, whatever they're called. Um, and I think that's, yeah, that's my only elite. And um, HQ, I've got Farsight there. And I've got... He's probably not in the tail codex, but he is. I got him from Forge World, that's why. Right. And for my heavy support, I've got my um, sniper drones, my broadsides, and my hammerhead. And for my fast attack, I've just got my um, piranhas there. So I'll just pass over to my brother. Right, this is mine. No Eldar for me today, I don't have my Eldar on me, so I've gone for the blue tide of the Ultramarines. In the middle here, HQ, we've got Captain Sicarius with a, um, what are they called? Honor Guard thing, but not the Chapter Master one. Um, other HQ, we've got Tigerius there with a the Stern Guard squad. Both of them are in, are in drop pods. Uh, troops, I have two uh, Taman Tactical squads with a Sergeant with a Power Fist. Uh, melter guns and last cannons, they're both in rhinos. I know I'm using Razorbacks, but we don't have um, rhino models, so just being proxied. Um, scout squad here, we've got nine scouts and Tilion. Uh, in the centre there, we've got Thunderfire cannon. I've never used one before, so I'm going to give it a try. In fact, I've never actually used Space Marines in 5th edition, so this will be a good battle for me. And over there, HQ um, Vindicator. Right, we'll roll off a mission and deployment, and we'll get back. Right, okay, deployment's done. I'd, um, we rolled for Annihilation Mission and Dawn of War deployment style. I've deployed a Rhino there with uh, 10 tactical marines in it. Okay. Uh, and I've deployed my, my scouts are tilling up on this hill. Everything else, my HQ, and obviously, because I don't know what everything else is in reserve. On my, on my brother's side, he's deployed 10 Fire Warriors in the building in the middle and 10 Fire Warriors in that building at the back. And Shazo Ramir over in the far corner. Everything else is in reserve because the Donor War um, deployment rules. Obviously first turn is night fighting and I'll do a video at the end of the first turn. Alright. Alright, so it's the end of turn one. My Rhino moved up to there. Um, the scouts fired on Ramir and took a wound off. Uh, the Fire Warriors shot at the Rhino when it was still there and failed to Glance its armour, they all bounced off. My, I used my drop pod special ability to drop in right behind there. Put some pop shots on the squad and I killed two from that fire warrior squad with combined plasma, bolt gun and melter fire. Um, from here was out of range of my scouts. So the battle rages on. I'll come back to it at the end of turn two. Right. right, turn two was an eventful turn. Go for the towel first. I lost my pretty much my entire scout squad to combined fire the uh, stealth suits came on there power shots in but then got destroyed in return Ramir moved to there shot a whole bunch of tower stuff came in the corner there some piranhas sniper drones fire warriors broadsides all shot my scouts wiped them out and just left um got his telly on then it got to my turn Sicarius and his squad shot and charged the fire warriors in that building and wiped them out Cut them down to a man, and then call me this group in advance. Um, my stern guard fired at the stealth suits that were there, destroyed them all, and then Tajiri did some psychic shooting powers and finished them off. Uh, nothing happened to Ramir. I fired the Deathwind missile launcher on that at him, but didn't do anything. Scattered away. Um, that Rhino is now mobilised, but the guys got out of it. Instead, destroyed the fire squad that was in that building. And it puts the score at 3 0 on kill points to me. We'll come back at the end of the next turn. Right, okay, end of turn three. Go for the Tau phase. The really only thing they did was they shot at Sicarius and his squad up there in that building, killed the Apothecary, the Gow the Melter Gun, yeah. and the 
Your librarian for And the company, the standard bearer. Then Farsight charged in, missed all his attacks. Then died in the ensuing combat. Got killed by Sicarius and Powerfist of the Veteran Sergeant. Um, down here, shots took at the squad librarian. They lost one. And then they fired back on Shazo Ramir and took the gun drone and two wounds off him. Uh, my turn, the Thunderfire Cannon came on and fired at the Fire Warriors up there, but he missed. Deathwind missile launches both missed. Uh, Chaos Carrius and the, the remaining of his conscript charged the broadsides in the corner up there, killed all three of them. And I've got to consolidate him up towards the sniper drones, but I'll do that now. But the end of the turn is going to have to be the end of the game due to lack of time. So, the kill point counter is 5 to the ultramarines and 0 to the Tau. If you would have been able to manage to kill Tilion over there, it would have been 5 1. But I didn't, nothing was destroyed completely. So he didn't get any kill points. I still had a Vindicator to come on the table. Everything in the towel was on. So, all in all, a good game and a resounding victory for the Ultramarines.